Hi everyone, welcome to Previsual Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how you can easily set up and showcase your design using ProVisual and 3D models. Let's navigate to the 3D Models section and select an object for our tutorial. The library contains a great variety of high-quality 3D mockups, and it is updated weekly. In this tutorial, we will learn how to customize the 3D mockup of the apron on the mannequin torso. Let's select the 3D model from the vast ProVisual library. I think this apron 3D mockup looks really beautiful. Let's create a new project. This is how our default model looks like. Let's zoom it in to be able to make our adjustments with more precision. Just look at the fabric detailing on both the mannequin and the apron. This is unbelievable. Let's start with the part called the apron. Let's apply a new color to this material. You can either select or customize the color using the color palette or by entering the color code manually like this. Let's copy this material and apply it to the belt. Next, we apply this material to the pocket and change the color. Let's turn the model around for more visibility and apply these material settings to the inner side of the apron. The next step, change the color of the material. Let's go back to the top of our model and set up the part called the ring. Let's change the color of the material. Next, we will also change the color of the seams. Done. We have adjusted the materials of our apron. Time to customize the mannequin. Let's change the color of the fabric on the mannequin. To do so, go to the base part and paint it in any color you'd like. Next, let's go to the bolts we will only change the color of the material. Let's copy this material and apply it to the socket and pole. Next, we apply this material to the adjuster. I like how the wooden parts of the mannequin are set up. Let's leave them as they are. We have adjusted all the materials of our apron mock-up. Now it's time to add the design to the apron. To add the design, click on the Add Design button on the Design Layers panel. You can also download a UV map and create your design in another editor. I've already prepared some images for our apron. Let's add the first design element. In the opened window, we see the editor where we can move and modify our design. Here, in the left window, the position of the design on the 3D model is displayed in real time. Now let's add the design to the pocket. To do this, click on the Add Image button. We'll place our design based on the UV map. You can change the opacity to see the edges of the UV map better and place your design more accurately. Excellent! Save the design. Wow! Just awesome! Need a good background for our 3D model? Let's see what types of pre-made backgrounds we have available. We can choose a solid fill as the background, or we can go for a gradient fill. Here we can select the desired colors and also set the direction of the fill, linear or radial. You can also pick one of the pre-designed backgrounds that we've prepared for you. Or add your own image. Let's add one.
good. You can turn on moving lights to see how the light can enhance the shape and texture of the 3D model. You can also rotate the 3D model to see how the design looks in motion. Let's save our project now. After you've completed your design, you can share it by clicking the share button. You'll get a shareable link to open the interactive viewer with your 3D model. Send it over to your colleagues, friends, or clients. And this is the end of our tutorial on creating an apron mock-up, torso, mannequin design. We hope this has been helpful for you. See you in the upcoming tutorials.